Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Empress Radio. So we have two new topics today. So in a post and delete by the Neighborhood Talk, it appears that DC Youngfly rapper um, from Wallin' Out may have found a new woman already. You know, um, Jackie O has just passed a few months ago, you know, um, after complications of a BBL or a mommy makeover. I'm not clear, but I know it's a mommy makeover or something. But yeah, so it said a video recorded by the girl of them at home playing around with the Jamaican accent, a clip from her story of the show, watching him perform, and then the two backstage joking around. And then there's a picture of of him, of her sleeping on his chest. So yeah, people aren't having that. You know, well, some people aren't surprised. They said, I'm surprised he wasn't seen with her sooner. Some said, these guys waste no time. It's barely been six months. Dang. Someone said, who else is surprised? Good for him. Life goes on. Um, wasn't he constantly cheating on his baby mom when she was alive? Also, men move fast when the woman they claim to love passes. They could have just lost their wife and two months later, they're in a new relationship. Someone said, I don't think that him and his baby mom were even together at the time of her passing. But yeah, so a lot of people are just like not surprised that she that he's done this. And, you know, there's some people who are up in arms. They said that Lauren London or Kobe's wife could never do that, you know, something like that, you know, um, just have moved on so soon without them getting dragged. But I'm sure if this does, you know, hit the big blogs that it will, he will eventually get dragged for this, you know, um, just moving on. It just kind of seems a little too soon. Maybe he should have just kept it private, you know, but I mean, people do move on. I've seen, you know, stranger things happen, you know. Okay, so I also want to talk about Kiki Palmer. Um, he has been granted sole uh, physical custody and a temporary restraining order against her ex, Darius. So we talked about this last night. So um, Kiki Palmer shared some disturbing uh, disturbing surveillance uh, photos of ex, Darius Jackson, allegedly abusing her, grabbing her at the neck. Um, uh, bless you, baby. Um, so yeah, it says that she was seeking sole custody of their eight month old son, Leo, uh, claiming in documents that Jackson attacked her on November 5th after she explained she didn't want Leo going to a football game. Um, at this point he lunged at me, grabbed, hold on, baby. Okay. It's okay. Yeah. At this point, he lunged at me, grabbed me by my neck and face, knocked me backwards over the couch, stole my phone, and and then ran out of the house. The photos attached to the file were of screenshots from Palmer's security cameras, appeared to show Jackson striking her so hard she tumbles over the couch. Well, Palmer 30 further alleges that Jackson nearly hit her with his car when he tried to flee the scene. Um... Let's see. These are just the pictures. I'm not going to post them, of course. Um, but yeah, in a separate incident from February 2020. You have the hiccups, baby? <laughs> the baby's so cute. In a separate incident from February 2022, Palmer claims Jackson became enraged when she showed him a photo of herself in a bikini to mark the progress of her fitness journey. In the bedroom, he slammed me on the floor and slapped my, my head from side to side. The next morning, he was standing at the bottom of the stairs near the front door screaming at me and I was coming down the stairs. She, she screamed. When I was almost at the bottom of the stairs, he grabbed me around the neck and then body slammed me back onto the stairs. So um, the whole neck stuff and, you know, uh, going for the neck is disturbing as it is because, you know, that's usually the rate of uh, women being unalived when men go for the neck, you know. So they're seven times more likely to get unalived in that type of situation. And, you know, we've we've heard that he's willing to unalive himself Um you know, uh, if threatened to, if she lit, left him. So that's very serious as well, you know. So these men definitely need to learn to keep their hands to their cells. Like, it's not anyone's fault. Well, it's his fault, but it's not Kiki's fault for choosing him, you know. um, Abuse, abusive men just are abusive, you know. So, but yeah, I'm not going to linger because my baby, he, he wants my attention. So, um, but what do you guys think about this? Drop your comments below and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more videos from Empress Radio. Okay, bye.